Hi there, this is Ginger Bratzel from New Patient Attraction Automation and gingerbratzel.com and this is the place for dentists to increase their new patients, keep more existing patients, create sustainable growth and increase your production. That's what we focus on for our clients. And today I'm going to talk about how to problem solve and resolve issues in your office and how to get to the next level. Um, I have a wonderful photo in um, my office from one of my clients who talked about this strategy and, and showed me visually how they did it in their office. And they were w working on their end of the year, what they wanted to accomplish. And we call it a, you know, a post-mortem sometimes. You know, where you are, where you want to be, um, we're going to not figure out how to get there just yet and get very clear what it's going to take to do it. And so and they went through and we, we taught them the strategy of grouping things together. So the first thing is you just bullet point, you brainstorm, you just let it all rip. And so we have somebody who has nice handwriting, it's not me by the way. And as quick as we can do this as a, as a group, go through and just write everything out and the more the merrier. And then we take those and we group them into categories. So is it where we are? Is it where we want to be? Is it an obstacle we have? And we make all these things. And so these huge problems sometimes that look in, uh, unable to overcome go away or are a lot more scalable in little mountains because you group them and look for patterns. And if you see patterns on how to solve them or patterns that have problems coming up, you know where to spend your time. So don't let the numbers of 1,050 things you need to do, group them together, recategorize them, look for patterns, and then concentrate on the big ones that are gonna get you the fastest results, not the biggest monsters. And that's what everyone's always assuming. Just like debt consolidation, don't think of the huge debt, um, start paying the biggest debt down first, the smallest one, so you can get it out of the way and you can put that money towards the other debt. Whittle down the ones that you can take care of rapidly, or delegate off to somebody else and then you can whittle away. So when you come to that big obstacle, you have the confidence you can handle it. You've resolved it and solutions you found from this lower ones will help you get to the big ones. And that's what the, the purpose of the pattern. So talking about an office meeting, that's one thing. And that's what, if, if not many offices do that, that's just one way. Writing on the board and making a brainstorm, that's the second step. But to really, to concentrate and write it down. And then take that sheet where you have it all grouped up, who's in charge of it, who you're gonna delegate, and what problems you're even gonna address, and assign that, and get those things done, and you will be able to tackle that. This is how one of the tools we use to help our clients get through and make big differences in their practice, dramatic increases, uh, problems gone away. If you wanna talk about how we can do this and help you in your practice, we'd love to talk to you. So you can email us at results at gingerbratzel.com or you can go to our website and get the phone number and call and we can set up a time for us to talk. Take care until next time and just knock it out of the park. I can't wait to hear how let you do with this. Bye-bye.